it's it's been amazing to see these two grow. Um, you know, it's kind of like looking at a fine bottle of wine with the perfect cheese. Um, <laughs> he's he's a good guy. He's a really good guy. I'm glad he finally found somebody to put up with him. But uh, they they make a great pair. They are very tenacious people. Um, when they want something, they go for it. And I think that's exactly what we've seen here from the two of them. Um, I've been through a lot with both of them. Um, they're two of my favorite people in the world. I'm going to keep this short and sweet. So if everybody can raise a glass. Yeah. May you guys live a long, happy, beautiful, incredible life together. I love you both. Congratulations. Have a wonderful night. Thanks for having me be a part of it. I love you both. To the bride and groom. Um, I'm Justine. I'm Ashley's little sister, in case you don't know me. Um, I think we should start this thing out by giving Blake a round of applause because he just married this babe. <laughs> Blake, this is your wife. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> um, to be honest, it was kind of hard for me to prepare a speech. Um, I was always really good in speech class. I like writing, so I thought this was going to come really easy for me. Um, but every time I sat down in the last few weeks to think about what to say, I just kind of came up blank for some reason. I thought at first maybe it was just the pressure because She's the pretty sister, but I'm the funny sister. So I know you guys are all expecting like a stand-up comedy routine right now. It's a lot of pressure. Um, but the more I thought about it, the more I kind of realized that it was hard for me because I don't think it's possible to put into words how happy I am for you. Um, you're the best friend and the best sister that I could ever imagine having. Um, not only are you unbelievably beautiful, but you are the kindest, <laughs> sweetest, most selfless person that I know. And I'm pretty sure all of you would agree with that. Um, you just deserve everything because that's what you give to everyone in your life every day. So I'm really glad that you found someone who appreciates how amazing you are. Um, I think that the best couples are the ones who have a lot of differences but still love each other despite them. And I think Blake and Ashley are definitely one of those couples. Um, for example, I don't know if you know this, but Ashley refuses to eat the meat from any animal that you could cuddle with. But Blake likes his steak medium rare. <laughs> um, they definitely have their differences, but I think at the end of the day, it's just the similarities that make this work. And the most important similarity that you guys have is why we're all here tonight, which is that you guys are married. And I'm so happy for you. I love you both so much. Um, yeah, I don't know. That's pretty much all I've got. I love you guys. You're amazing. Well, one thing, I can't be any happier than I am tonight for Blake and Ashley. And I want to thank everybody that showed up and it made this such a special, special night. And especially Grandma Ruth, coming all the way from Broken Bow. Give her a big hand, would you please? <laughs> Thanks, Grandma. Blake and Ashley, I didn't really think this was ever going to happen, but you know what? I'm sure glad it did. And it was a beautiful wedding. Thank you very much. I'm the shy one. Yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know. Blake's my baby. This is this is this is really hard. And and um, they've been together for so long. And, and so I'm just, I'm glad they're married. And, and Ashley is so sweet. And, and I'm, it's just, um, I'm a mom. Anybody that's a mom can go, yeah, I get it. And so I'm, I'm a praying mother, so I'm just gonna pray for them to be um, totally united, totally one, happy. And when they go through the rough spots, that uh, suffering thing, that they will they will make it through, and they will hold each other up, and and uh, they will be one, and they'll make it through all the rough stuff. So, I love you both. God loves you, and you're doing good. Yeah. 
I thought I had this down cold. Um, I put it in writing, and I've been practicing it all week. But I have to admit, um, I'm 53 years old, and I'm freaking nervous. <laughs> it's it's just a different ball game when you have all these people. But um, anyway, so I made I made she a little bit look at the note cards, but. I assure you I wrote all this and it's all from the heart. But obviously, um, thanks to family and friends for being here. Um, Blake and Ashley are thrilled that you're all here as, as we are. Um, it's a great gathering. Uh, that's what it's all about, friends and family. Um, and we appreciate also the efforts of friends and family that uh, put in a lot of work to put this together. We had a little, few little hurdles, but I think it's, uh, the ceremony, this fits everybody. It fits Blake and Ashley. They're informal people. They're non-traditional people, but they love their family and friends. So everyone that helped out, um, thank you. It's, your efforts are appreciated. We couldn't have done it without you. And then I want to shout out um, to my beautiful bride, Chris. Yes, mama! My partner in crime for 31 years and the rock of our family. Um, you're an amazing wife and mother. Thank you for your countless hours of prep and planning to make this day extra special for Blake and Ashley. I think you, I think you pulled it off, honey. I love you. And I know the smart money uh, today was on me being a blubbering idiot through the entire day. But I'm working real hard to uh, keep it together because um, this is a real special day for Blake and Ashley. Um, the next step in their journey together, and that's a journey that started a little over eight years ago. You've, most of you have heard most of the story, but uh, it started when they, they were formally introduced the night of Ashley's 21st uh, birthday party, uh, her, her party bus tour. <laughs> and that night... Ashley declared to her mother that she'd met her soulmate. And we figured it was just the alcohol talking. <laughs> but before too long, Blake moved uh, from Arizona back to Nebraska, and the dating game began. And of course, they had their typical ups and downs. A um, few tears here and there, some late night drama. But they persevered and continued together, working on their relationship. <laughs> I got a lot of note cards. You got it, Dad. You got this. But no, seriously, it has been real gratifying for um, Chris and I to witness you guys growing together and maturing uh, and becoming two pretty darn fine adults, I would say. We're all excited to uh, see what you guys can accomplish together in the future. And to the handsome groom, is that what you wanted me to say, honey? Handsome? <laughs> to the handsome groom, Blake. Blake, thank you for making my daughter very, very happy. That's all any dad can want. So continue to do that. Yeah. <laughs> Chris and I have always admired your work ethic, your, your talented, creative, handyman skills, and your man bun. <laughs> but ser no, seriously, Blake, even though, even though you've been long considered a part of our family, you've been around for quite a long time, we're thrilled to death to, that you're officially Ashley's husband and our favorite son-in-law. <laughs> we love you, Blake. And to the stunningly beautiful bride, Ashley Jordan. I wish, uh, how I wish your grandma Donnie could be here today. She, um, you've grown into a, such a wonderful, warm, compassionate woman. Um, being proud parents to both of you, Ashley and Justine, is, uh, continues to be Chris and I's uh, very favorite job. We know you will excel as wife, and perhaps mother, just, just saying, just as you have in all of your other lifetime roles. 
You bring us joy every single day. And I know you haven't been just daddy's girl for quite some time now, but please know that I cherish the fact and will always be your daddy. I love you. All right, I'll wrap it up. Now let please join me in toasting Blake and Ashley to the bride and groom. So um, I know usually the groom is the one that talks at this point in time, but, um, you know, I think Blake's hit his max for um, talking in front of people tonight. So um, since I'm so great at it, I'll just say a few words. Um, no, we just really want to thank every single one of you for being here. Um, I know my dad already touched on this, but mom, seriously, you kicked ass. Where are you at? Mommy, yes. Thank you so much for everything that you did for us. This turned out beautiful. And I also want to say, ooh, I want to say thank you so much to this amazing freaking wedding party. You guys are insane. I love you all. Thank you so much. Kyle killed it. Yes. Thank you, Kyle. You are awesome.